we wake Hear the birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun Hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy But things are finally right With you and I The future is bright Good morning, happy peoples. Hope your day is going awesome. Today, things are going awesome here. We are still in Denali National Park at the Riley Creek Campground. We're getting all loaded up. Our checkout time, we're learning a little bit late, but the uh, guy that runs this said he, we could have a little bit more time, which is super, super nice of him. Already had a nice fire. What do you think so far, Audrey? I think it's awesome. And I think that, uh, we're just gonna have fun today and we're gonna go on hikes and trails and we're gonna go have fun, but right now we're packing, so. <laughs> <laughs> I know, we gotta get out of here. So Denali National Park is one of the most popular parks, definitely the most popular destination here in Alaska. We're gonna do some, some recon, go check out uh, what's happening, but I mean, we'll show you when we leave. The, the hotels, all of the, the peripherals, the restaurants, the rafting, all of the the, the bus routing, all of this is like shut down uh, due to this current crazy pandemic we're all fighting through. They said that in a 12 month period, roughly 400,000 people will visit this park and it will be much less than that this year, <laughs> much lower numbers. Um, but you know, we're still, we're gonna go check it out. We're gonna go take this time to, because it's usually, so this is sort of the silver lining here, is it's normally really hard to get like a spot to be able to try to, uh, you know, really go out and do much because there's so many people and there's still quite a few people, but nowhere near what there normally is. Use this time, go explore Denali, we'll bring you with us. We just need to be very alert for wildlife because this is, a lot of you guys were concerned about, you know, wildlife at our house. Well, Compared to here, this is literally the wilderness. Uh, have a good time, see if we can see something beautiful. It was raining all night, but it stopped raining, but it looks pretty overcast, so I don't know if we'll be able to see Denali, but we're gonna go check it out. All right, let's get on the road. Good job. I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day. I'm trying to make this darkness go away. I'll paint with colors and I'll sing until my lungs give out. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day. And I will leave my windows open so that I can hear the sound of. People you know what we're gonna do? Look up there. Do you think do you think we can make it all the way up there? Yeah. Hang on, wait, wait, wait. There's still a road. Come over here, come over here. Here we go, let's wait for mommy. decided to drive into the parkaways and we decided to come climb the mountain <laughs> little rock formation that's kind of out over here quite a ways up you can see where's our camper there's our camper 
Right down there. A cute little rock formation. So I guess probably about an hour or so ago, an actual grizzly bear was spotted down the riverbed here. We've already seen a caribou. Uh, so we're being very cautious. We're making sure that we're staying alert. Um, Making lots of, noise. Lots, of noise. lots of noise, but it's beautiful. Look, head up, maybe a little bit that way. Explore this beautifulness. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see when we get maybe closer to the top. Here we are. We made it to the top of the mountain. Yeah. Good job. Let's not fall off. Don't get crazy. What does this look like? Here. Mountain. Mountain? Yeah, whoa. Like a mountain of ice cream? I don't like oh, it. Let's not climb up there, bud. That looks pretty slippery. Okay, we got a casualty here. We got a cat. Oh. is cooking. It is absolutely cooking down here. This fun? Are you having a good time? Yeah. My goodness, guys, this was ab it's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. We've never walked inside of the park. Sorry the wind is bad, but literally in a mountain range. Yeah. All the way around us. We've got a river off to the side. Beautiful! It's absolutely beautiful. The kids are doing a great job. This is about a two mile hike. So if you ever get a chance, come to Denali National Park. Go explore it. There's tons and tons of trails you can go on. Uh, just make sure you're safe. Use precautionary. Yeah. Oh, the wind kind of died down. Yay! Going into like a boulder face here. Wow. Absolutely beautiful. And snow! It's winter now, guys! Yeah! Here we go. It's really cold snow. Like, really cold.
normally when we come here, this is we would walk all these shops and go in and check cool Alaskan trinkets and snacks. But this is this is really sad to see. I, this is crazy. This this town normally will go from completely shut down the winter to one of the highest populated towns in all of Alaska overnight and all summer long. It is bustling and hustling. And this is just so sad. I mean, 400,000 people will come here in a year. 400,000 people are probably not coming here this year. And it's just, it's so sad to not have, I mean, you just have this incredible creation that we just walk through and the mountains and the wildlife and people that would come here from all over the world and they're not gonna it's not gonna happen this year and I know it's not just us a lot of you know tourist type towns I'm sure are suffering huge or uh, you know imagine all of the all of the cruises that will not go this year all of the neat places that people won't be able to see this year just because of this crazy weird time in the world that's all right we had fun though right guys we have yeah. fun I'm gonna go in this little shop right oh, here. Oh, okay. Yeah. Let's go in here. <laughs> <laughs> Those are so cute. Decided to swing by to see if any of the shops were over open, and some of them are, not all of them. But there was this little shop that was open. It's got all like little knickknacks and stuff. Not really any restaurants that we've seen um, that really have been open. It's just really sad. It's kind of really sad to see all these little shops, you know, that really survive, like really depend on this for their living for the for the summer. But there are little shops here and there. It's just really sad to see. But I'll be curious to see as like time progresses. Maybe things will open up more. But like I didn't see any of the adventure things like rafting, zip lining, any of those places that were open. No restaurants so far. Little gas stations here and there and then some little gift shops. So I don't know, but we still had a blast coming here and enjoying the outdoors because that's really what you come for. Get a food though. Alaska on it. I'll go put huh? this back for you. Yeah. Decided since my mom didn't come with us on this trip, I'm gonna bring her back some wild huckleberry crunch. It's like a popcorn. Hey guys, let me know. Have you ever been to a national park? If so, which one have you gone to? What was your favorite thing about it? Um, this is definitely a different season for us here. We've come, we normally try to make it here at least once a year um, in the summertime, but this year is definitely different. So let me know, comments below, if your parks are, are seeing some different craziness that's been going on or, or whatnot. So I think we're gonna call this one a day. We are gonna jump in the car and head about 150 miles back home. <laughs> I'm thinking the kids are gonna sleep a very, very long time. But thank you guys so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Take it away, kids.